Hey, what's up citizens? This is President Vocelli back with another episode of Pokemon Snakewood. So, we're gonna go even further down into the Lily Cove sewers, to the place I have not been yet, because I think it's, like, the place of no return. Okay, um... I remember I had a problem escaping from Quillfishes before, so let's go ahead, get something, you know, actually fast, fast out, like a uh, Scrappy-Doo. Oh, yeah. And, uh, that looks like where I need to go. What? I'm gonna explore a little bit more first. Regular regurgitation pumping station. Do not feed the goo. Oh, boy, that sounds utterly pleasant. I wonder if I'm gonna get a waterfall anytime soon. You know, or strength, because... It appears I, like, need all of that in order to actually progress in this damn game. Alright, well, let's go in. Why am I getting, like, flashbacks to uh, Lieutenant Surge's gym? Nothing happened. Lever's jam. Nothing. Nothing. Something just happened. Nothing, 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 and nothing. So, another trollish cutlerine moment for all of you. So what happened, what happened, what happened? I am quite curious to know. Um... Uh, um, 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 Alright, how about if I use a Max Repel? How about that? Uh, where's my Max Repels? I, I probably, like, passed right over it and you're, like, screaming at me right now. Sorry! Sorry. Alright, uh, well, I'm, I'm... I'm just not seeing anything. They say something happened. Oh, oh! Oh, well, that one didn't stop. Uh, and that one's not gonna stop. So, we're gonna go through here. Oh, no, teleportation pads. Uh... <laughs> Why, Cutlerine? Why? Alright, uh, that's where I started off, right? Damn it. Seems that this is another set of one-way stairs. Alright. All right, so that's- that- that doesn't help. That doesn't help. Um, okay, awesome. What if I go here? Uh, ah, I'm just gonna figure this off off-camera. Oh, thank god! Baby Jesus, I made it somewhere. Oh, thank Arceus, Baby Gumi, I made it somewhere. To make it a little more appropriate and non, you know, offensive. Oh, wait! Wait, 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 wait! Oh, 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 that's where that event with Glyce was supposed to happen. Now I comprehend. Kind of, not really. So, uh, do I need to keep teleporting to find my way? <sighs> Alright, I'm back, citizens. So, yeah, nothing happened while I was exploring that exit to, um, the Lily Cove sewers. So, I went to Sutopolis City, seeing if I could, like, find another way in. And what I found, actually, was an abandoned gym. Um, oh. Well, the doors are bolted. Uh, Hoenn Natural Trust Info Board. Abandoned gym. This is a gym that was once in use to train gym leaders for the Hoenn League. However, it has been abandoned for 50 years, and that time has been locked up because a monkey demon has got in, and no one wants to get it out. Maybe this is gonna be stupid. Maybe there's, like, a way in the back. I, I, I don't know. Maybe? 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 No. Alright, back to the drawing board, but... Yeah. Hey, what's up, citizens? 
So, so for the past couple of episodes, we've been doing side quests. Simple as that. What I actually should have done was I should have looked up here in Pacifidelog City to go through this cave to challenge a gym. Yo, this here's Esau's gym. He and his disciples are masters of Spiral. Oh, God. Spiral energy, the force, and every mystic power in existence. You're going to need mind force to beat him. Oh, right. What? Oh, come on, come on. Trainer is not supposed to be right at the entrance of the gym. But he's out to challenge you. You have to have beaten all of us. Alright, that's no problem. That's no problem. Why Sage Toru would like to battle? Sending out that level 70 Claydol. My goobity goodness. Okay, well, I do um, have the potential to two shot this, except if I had another bite, will not take it out, and I get exploded on it. Well, oh well. Oh well. Vigorlan! Wait, no! Okay, well, I was meaning to fake out. Obviously, it didn't work out like that, because, um, yeah, I changed around Luncheon's moves, then I'm like, oh, yeah, I need Rock Smash after all, and, uh, yeah. Okay, so, uh, if I stay in here, I'm going to absolutely freaking screw myself. Uh, Data Stream. Damn it! None of this is okay. None of this. That didn't even do anything. Iron Slam. Iron Slam. You missed! You dang missed! Excuse me, why didn't my spore work? Uh, toxic then? No, no, I, I just died. I just died. Okay, alright, cool. Well, your psychic's not gonna work against a fucking dark fire orange. Fire blast, your fucking ass! Fire blast again? Apparently not. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, well, actually, you can't damage me if anything else. You can only put me to sleep. Damn it. <sighs> ah! It worked! It worked! I weaseled my way out of that situation. Thank goodness. Alright, Sydney, Sydney, come out, do your thing. Um, actually, probably Storm Surge is um, more powerful. It is, it is. Oh. This is not the time to be missing it! I chose willpower. I've... It failed. It failed. Alright, off to the Pokemon Center after that brutal, brutal anal thrashing I just got. And let's try it again. What do you have to say for yourself? What do you have to say? Go on. I will go on. It does not matter what type your Pokemon are, what matters is your fighting spirit! You don't have Levitate, so an Earthquake will completely and utterly bother you. Good to know. <sighs> so, citizens, I I'm kind of wondering, have you ever played a game where, you know, y you just got really tired of it after a while, but for whatever reason, you still kept going? I, I mean, obviously, obviously, this is a little reference to how I feel about this game right here! You know, but you know, they're just a game that's particularly frustrating, or di you know, difficult or stupid. But you just went along with it anyways. And if so, why? You know, was 
did it just did it have some sort of uh, redeeming aspects that uh, made it a guilty pleasure, perhaps? I guess we'll go on Rock Tomb. Rock Tomb! Shyster! Earthquake. Let's see how that much how much that does. Uh, not as much. Damn it! Oh, okay. That works. Uh, Beedrill. b b b b b Alright, uh, Dodrio, best, uh, thing for that. Well, I also need to gain some levels on some of these, um, some of these dudes, so let's just go ahead and surf all over this thing. The meaning of life is your face! Your face, your mom, insert juvenile comebacks. No. It's all an illusion, all just smoke and mirrors. So I'm also thinking, on the flip side of that, is there a game that you actually really, really liked? That was actually really good? But, but, that you just couldn't finish for whatever reason. Like, it was just too long, you got distracted by other games. I'm gonna rock tomb it. Okay, go ahead and substitute. Then I earthquake. Then I earthquake again. And uh okay, there we go. Wish cash, of course we have Joel for that. Now I know there's plenty of games like that. Like I have so many goddamn games that I really, really wanted to That I really wanted to finish, you know, that I bought with my own money. Sometimes at full price, but I just didn't finish it for whatever reason. God, save a lie. Ah, God, save a lie! I don't know, how much does a bite do? Bite! Smoke and mirror. You know, for example, um, I bought the game Nino Kuni. Uh, it was a game on the, P uh, on the PS3 that was made in, like, um, you know, the Miyazaki film's art style. You know, I actually had some of the writers from there to make the story, um, you know, and other people to consult on the art direction and whatnot. You know, I bought that, um, I think it was, like, for $40. I have not played it. I have not touched it. Just, God damn it! You know, just who has time to play all these games? There's so many goddamn great games out there. You know, and I, I just can't, I just can't go through them all. It's, it's a damn shame. It really is. You know, but again, what games like that do you, do you have, citizens? I have no idea what it was. It is a hyper egg. Uh, which is just a normal type, but has a shit ton of HP. Okay, why is all, why is all my storm surges missing? Oh my god, that did nothing. Th that did nothing. That did so much! Alright, Joel, 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 come out here. Toxic this thing. And get great. Oh shit, it's in the red! I got a full restore! Ah! That's not okay! Cut. Cut. Damn it! Oh god, why? Why? This is not okay! <sighs> not just those are we disciples. I think I, I think I completely ignored the antecedent to that statement. Right, but anyways, anyways, we should be at the gym leader now, and I don't care if I'm under level. I'm just gonna go ahead and go through with it. After, 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 after a save. 
It's a huge wall mirror. <gasps> I'm fighting myself? Think of something apt to say. BREAK IT! But your fist curls back around on itself as you swing at it, and you end up punching yourself in the face, knocking out a few teeth. Well, I got some teeth. Candyman! But nothing happened. Da -da -da. Whoa! What, what what happened? What happened? Alright, so was that, was that in my key items pocket? No, it was my regular items pocket. May cause flinching when the foes hit. You know what? Sure, let's do it! Go on. Defeating us all earned defeating us all earned you the chance to fight Esau. The point of our existence is to provide entertainment to deities known as game. What you perceive as reality and what is reality are two entirely different things. Depending on your zodiac year, fate may have uh, different things in store for you. Alright. No, okay, nothing happened. Nothing happened. Say the word. Nothing happened. Yes. Say the word. Nothing happened. Yes. Whoa, a huge black guy with a hook for a hand just materialized and killed you. Well, that's unfortunate. Harry Man. Nothing happened. Right, so nothing's gonna happen there either. Okay, so where do I go from here? So where is this Esau? How do I fight this Esau? Maybe I just break it again. Okay, well I keep obtaining some teeth. Okay, and not saying Candyman uh, doesn't help. So. So, uh, let me go ahead and try to, uh, figure this out, uh, you know, how I can actually FIGHT the damn gym leader. Well, well, stupid, stupid me. Of course, of course. What I was supposed to do is talk to a little girl in Pacific Delog town, uh, where she said, Oh, Esau is always hungry, gives you chikaos. Uh, then I'm supposed to go to this one particular Pokemon Center in, um, Lily Cove City, talk to this chef, buy, um, food. Go back. Not in there. But to the gym. Talk to the mirror. Say Harry Man. And there we go. Obviously. Aha! Red Stew, give me that. I'm famished. Sell me your birthright first. Don't think that one hasn't been tried on me before, kid. I'm Esau and I am a skillful hunter. There's no way you'll get the better of me, so hand over that stew! Wow, they actually use the gym leader music for a gym leader. Oh, fuck you then. Uh, extreme speed, is that enough? Okay, well that'll work. That'll work. Uh, I guess. Maybe. Perhaps. Probably. Not really. Alright, Sydney. Go ahead and show this Ken Chuko your stuff. Show your moves. 
Aha, you missed your fucking hyper beam. You didn't miss that one, though. Alright, well, that's okay, because now you have to wait a turn. Well, I get a nice data stream off, and bam, you're dead, son. Oh, no. Not a basculin! Wow, that one particular note there really hurt my throat. Alright, so let's see. We have a chicken, a fish... Okay, I, I thought there was, like, some sort of theme going on here. I mean, no, there, there's no way. There's no way I'm switching out. I'm just going data stream all over your face. And I don't care. You're dead. You're dead, son. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. It's, it's a crit, too! Uh, yeah, I suppose I should go back. Um, go ahead, send Joel out, so I can spore. Spore! We have Vital Spirit. Okay, then! Masher. Masher, Fire Blast, please. Fire Blast! Fire Blast! Thank you. And then Spirit Tomb, the one that got away. Now we'll just send this thing out and Iron Slam for days. That did quite a lot, actually. Of course, I keep missing. No, 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 Oh, this thing has pressure, doesn't it? Under pressure! Huh. Damn it! I uh, received the focus badge from East Sal's mirror. There. You've even got my badge. Now I'll make it with the stew. Okay. Thanks. That's good stew. Uh, I know this guy called Dr. Blackthorn, and he said you'd, uh, train me to fight the evil necromancer that's threatening Hoans. So, uh, I can find my brother? Yes, that I can do. Meet me at Sundance Rock at midnight. Wait, where's Sundance? Damn it, yet another puzzle. Something else to figure out. Come on. Uh, well, let's just see real quick if I can actually figure out what the hell he's talking about. Uh, uh nope. <laughs> nah, I'll, I'll go ahead and give it a chance. And by chance, I mean I'm going to casually sc stroll around. Uh, was that in Duford? No, that's just solar caverns. Uh... All right, all right. I'm just gonna look it up because I, 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 no, no, no. I'm in no mood to try to figure this out, and you know, waste my time exploring this entire goddamn region again. Aha! Uh -huh, so apparently, I was actually on the right track. I'm supposed to go in here. All right, and then um, Sundance Rock. There we go. All right, so let's go ahead, get on my Vespa. Shit! Uh, but we got TM-22. Uh, oh, and I got all the badges too, so that is amazing. Uh, and TM-22 is Solar Beam. Too bad I have nothing that can really take advantage of it. I'm sure there's a solution to this. Okay. So it might not be the Vespa. No, it is the Vespa. Damn it! 
Damn it! Janet! Alright. So, we'll just go ahead and assign the Vespa to select. Wait. What? 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 Huh? Alright, so it, take, it takes a while for it to get up to speed. There we go. There we go. I think I got this figured out now. Alright, so I need to go back here. Meow. 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 Damn it! <laughs> Alright. Let's try it. Uh. Again! And again. Yes! Mad skills, y'all. I guess this is it. Sundance Rock. Isao doesn't seem to be around here anywhere, though. That's what you think! That's right, I'm inside Sundance Rock. Out of curiosity, is there a Cassidy Rock? Why, yes, there is. Down in the old abandoned mines. How do you know? Called Hunch. Sundance Cassidy. I don't, I don't get it. Go ahead and explain it to me in the comments, citizens. Called Hunch. Okay, so, um... What have you got to teach me? It will take many, many, many years to teach you the art of sagely combat. I'm kind of in a hurry here. I have to save Owen. Christ, kids have no patience. Too many damn video games. Are you breaking the fourth wall? Me never. Anyways, it will take many years to teach me five minutes. No, it's traditional. I didn't want to have to do this, but... Nya, 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 You married a... Hitite... No, damn you. She's a nice woman. She's a... Hitite... No, stop making Genesis jokes. They'll tear at my soul. Only if you teach me quickly. Fine, fine. Just leave my wife out of this. No. Alright, how do we do this? Regrettably, there's only one way to make a long job like this take just a few minutes. A montage? Yes, a montage! Yes, a montage! Ah, yes. The ancient art of Vespa training. Wait, wait, wait. Stop the music! What's up? Don't you want to learn? But isn't this just me looking left and right, such to the music? What kind of a montage is that? Well, a montage of someone meditating isn't going to be particularly interesting, is it? Ah, screw you, Esau. And your Hitite wife, too. I'm leaving for Sutopolis. Wait, you don't even know how to get there. I don't care. I'm sick of your stupid esoteric crap. Don't you realize what you are? You're an extended joke based on a chapter from Genesis. Oh, okay. No, you mustn't say that. If you reveal what I am a reference to, I will die forever. That's stupid. This whole world is stupid. The Deadly Seven are stupid. The zombies are stupid, and you're stupid, Esau! You're nothing but a commentary on the ridiculous nature of Esau's meeting with Jacob at the time of the Red Stew. No, I'm dying. Crackadoom! Esau? Oh, this is bad. I think I just killed him. Damn it! I have to get out of this. Uh, get out of here. No one can know about this. But I did find Excalibur. Well, lucky me. Uh, raise the power of some steel type moves. Now, actually, funny enough, a uh, murder camera here uh, has a higher attack than special attack, so Iron Slam will technically do more damage. But... Uh... Professor, yo, house things. Now's not a great time. I think I just killed someone. That's great. <laughs> Listen, have you heard of a guy called Esau? Uh, Professor, that's what I'm trying to. You have good. He's the kind of guy who would prove a useful ally in your quest. I'm trying to tell. So what I want you to do is go and ask him for help in finding land in a May. Yeah, no offense, but you're not doing so well on your own. Shut up and listen. Thank you. Now here's what I. Now here's what happened. I got angry and I accidentally killed killed Esau. What? I know, I know, but holy humbones, Lobo! What is wrong with you? You just killed a guy. <laughs> I know, I know, and that's why I need your help. <laughs> what do I do, Birch? What do I do? <laughs> Professor? Okay. Okay, this was an accident. Right? Yeah, could could have happened to anyone. <laughs> okay, listen to me. Here's what you're gonna do. Absolutely nothing. Carry on as usual. What but I an accident? Any witnesses? No, then it's fine! Jeez, you had me worried there for a moment. No one can prove anything. It's fine, you'll be fine. But what about the morality of it? There's no time for morality here, Loba! Wake up already! This world is screwed! All I want is my daughter back, okay? I don't care who dies anymore. Professor Birch, are you okay? No, Loba! No, I'm not! Click! He hung up. He must be getting really worried. 
Ever find Landon in May, or he might never recover. That means breaking into Sutopolis, but how to do that? I guess there's only one thing to do. I have to seek out Dr. Blackthorn. I need his help. Here, alrighty then. So, finding Dr. Blackthorn is going to be a job for the next episode, and I think I have to go back to Moss Deep City. And, um, that's going to be, eh, you know, you know, all I have to do is go through Victory Road. It's not that big of a deal. So, anyways, thank you very much for watching this episode of Citizens. Thank you for sharing my pain and frustration at this god diggity damn game. And with all of that said, this has been President Bocelli, signing off.